It's the holiday season for school children and experience alien to their counterparts who are of school age but are not privileged to go to school. In Nigeria, there are more than 10 million of them. The Minister of Education during his reappointment screening at the Senate says the public primary school story is a sad one. We concluded the study. We have about 10,475,031 out of school children in Nigeria, and it is still the highest. But the work to reduce this is for the states. And the federal government is not in a position to force the states to do so. Poor primary school enrollment is a problem, but the quality of education the enrolled pupils are getting is another. From the north to the south, there are stories of pupils in makeshift classrooms, poor sanitation, yet willing to learn one word at a time. One of those stories is that of the Spopils. The school proprietor in Makoko, a neighborhood across the Third Melon Bridge, runs a hybrid of public and private school. It says it charges next to nothing considering its environment. We have an experience of many guys here who are taught, who are area boys, and we believe that it's because uh, most of them they lack, uh, lack uh, proper education at the initial stage of life. So we're like, okay, what can we do? So this thing will not come to repeat itself. So we're like, okay, let's bring education to the children because someone said that a charity begins at home and uh, you know, it's better to catch them young. We're able to teach them good moral at the, in, at the early life of theirs. They will grow with that and the issue of criminality, armed robbery in the society and the community will be minimized. Joy Ademulegu, social worker, inspired by stories she's read, says she's on a mission to help children, especially those in communities like Makoko, have access to quality methods of teaching. We have several of those kids who cannot read and write, even at age 15. Reading could be very difficult if you are using the uh, alphabetical means, so we decided to use the phonics means, the jolly phonics and the Mon uh, Montessori means of teaching. And so far, so good. It's been a fantastic journey. This is a church, but for now it is serving other purpose than a place of worship. These children from ages 3 to 13 are learning how to read. And for their teachers, it is not the best learning condition, but for now, knowledge is being imparted. High poverty level has been identified as factors affecting primary school education and also contributing to poor school enrollment. But with states stepping up to the plate, the numbers can be reduced drastically. Daredu, Chinese Television News.